بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم السلام علیکم فارمر چیف جسٹس آف پاکستان جواد ایس خواجہ آن ٹیوزڈے فائلڈ اے پٹیشن ان دا سپریم کورٹ چیلنجنگ دا ٹرائلز آف سولینس تھرو ملٹری کورٹس ہی فائلڈ اے پٹیشن انڈر آرٹیکل ون ایٹی فور تھری آف دا کانسٹیٹیوشن میکنگ دا فیڈریشن آف پاکستان اے ریسپونڈنٹ تھرو دا لا ڈیفینس سیکرٹریز اینڈ پروویژنل چیف سیکرٹریز دا فارمر چیف جسٹس سبمٹیڈ دیٹ دا انسٹنٹ پٹیشن ڈز ناٹ سیک ٹو سپورٹ اور اٹیک اینی پولیٹیکل پارٹی اور انسٹیٹیوشن adding that it raises an important constitutional question involving fundamental rights that requires adjudication in the present circumstances. The petitioner has no personal interest in this case, and the relief sought is for the benefit of all citizens, regardless of political affiliation. Justice Khwaja said in the petition submitted through his counsel, Khwaja Ahmed Hussain, the former CJP prayed the apex court to declare that when ordinary courts are functioning, court martial of civilians by military courts is unconstitutional similarly he prayed the court to declare the sections 21d1 and 2 of the pakistan army act 1952 are inconsistent with the fundamental rights conferred by the constitution and are void and struck down the former chief justice further prayed to the apex court that the respondents be directed to maintain and furnish a list of all civilians in military custody and details of where they are being detained and to declare that any proceedings against civilians are unlawful and direct that such civilians be transferred to the competent civilian authorities for appropriate proceedings before ordinary criminal courts. The petitioner submitted that the Pakistan Army Act 1952 is meant to maintain the internal discipline of the armed forces and cannot extend to civilians when ordinary courts are functioning. He further submitted that the trial of civilians by military courts when the armed forces are called in aid of civil power in contrary to Article 245 of the Constitution as it displaces civil power and does not aid it. The military as part of the executive cannot undertake trials as judicial power, can only be exercised by the judiciary while the trial of civilians by military courts also in fingers upon Article 175.3 of the Constitution and is contrary to the separation of powers. The petitioner submitted.